Good morning, staff and students. At this time, we ask everyone to please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you very much. You may be seated. And at this time, please pause for a moment of silence. Thank you very much. Mr. Rudolph, why don't you lead us off? All right. So just a reminder to anybody about student council elections to be sure to uh, get those applications done and turned in and submitted uh, by tomorrow at 3.30. If you have any questions about those applications, uh, be sure to let myself or Ms. Ponder know. You guys have seen some awesome student leaders over the last two weeks on the morning announcements. Uh, so uh, the, to give you some great reasons as to why that you should be a part, now is a great time uh, to get involved. So if you have any questions, please let a student council member uh, or myself know. Uh, second announcement is for teachers. Teachers, don't forget from Jacket Wednesday about uh, care cards. I sent that email out yesterday. The form is now live. Be sure to go through and to sign up. We would like for you to have uh, uh, your sign-ups uh, done uh, by uh, Friday. So uh, please be sure to do that. And uh, cards and stationery are available in the front office if you have any questions. Please let myself or another member of instructional support team know. All right, very good. All right, students, less than five weeks, approaching four weeks till exams. This is not the time to leave a bad impression with your teachers. In fact, this is the time to leave a good impression with your teachers. No matter what's happened up to this point, you got really like four plus weeks to really make sure you and your teachers are in good standing and that they're prepared to do all they can to help you here at the end of the year. Uh, don't come back here in these last few weeks after spring break and make mistakes and uh, cause your teachers to have sort of a bad impression of you right here at the end. That includes getting to class on time. It's a small thing, but it's a big thing, right? Everything starts with being in your seat and ready to go at the beginning of the class. So we've turned the bells back on. Tardies will start counting next week, and we will start applying consequences, including lunch detention for those first three tardies that you get. So make sure you go into class on time. Today is the final day to register for the driver's education course for the month of May. So if you are planning on doing it and you haven't done it, no time to waste. Today is the last day to get signed up. Upward bound students, all upward bound students, listen to me. You are to meet in Miss Massey's class after school today. Very, very important. Make sure you are there. All library books and materials need to be returned immediately. We're approaching the end of the year. They got to get everything inventory. Seniors in particular, make sure you are taking care of that because you will not be able to walk across that stage and participate in our graduation ceremony unless you are clear of everything. Media center and technology items are included there. Seniors, don't forget to fill out the decision day form. Prom tickets, you got two days left to buy your tickets, today and tomorrow, that's it. After tomorrow, we're cutting off sales. We're gonna have a prom on May 15th, with or without you. We would rather it be with you, but you gotta get your tickets so we can plan uh, everything for the prom. Don't forget, we got two prom dress events coming up. One on May, uh, excuse me, one on April 24th, which is like day after tomorrow. Christina Whitley, Forest Hills graduate, past student body president, a Stuco, a wonderful Stuco member, will be the guest speaker at that event. Um, and then we have another one here at the school on April 28th. If you need any more information about prom dress events, see your counselor. They'll get you signed up appropriately. Tutoring center, don't forget about that after school today. Remember, we don't have it on Fridays, but Monday through Thursday. And that's really all I've got. So proud of all of you. You know what? We focus way too much sometimes on those few students who aren't doing what they're supposed to. Almost all of you are coming to school every day doing everything you're asked to do. We really appreciate you. Jacket Nation is so proud of its students for fighting through such tough circumstances. And our staff and teachers, too. Thank all of you for what you're doing. Have a great day, everybody. I feel like I'm yelling. Ha, ha, ha.